Hello everybody, this is Drew Naylor, and today I'm going to be showing you how to, uh, well, how I'm going to try to be fixing um, VMware Workstation, because as it is, I'm on Windows 10 19.03 and Workstation 14 can't run. As you can see right here, it's Windows 10 19.03, um, and it, it couldn't run just now. It asks me to check for updates with the uh, to for a new version, and um, but I kind of can't. In that version, I don't want to buy a new version copy of version 15 because 14 works just fine. And this particular version came out March 2019. Um, so earlier tonight, I upgraded to Windows 10 1903 because support for 1803. Or no, yeah, 1903, because support for 1803 was going out. Um, so I found this post on 10 forums about ways that you can fix this issue. And so I'm going to be doing it with this, um, this registry information. So I've got it right here, right in this file. I would recommend doing a restore point before doing this. I already did that, but it shouldn't matter anyway. So before you apply this, and I'm going to be applying this right now, and adding information can unintentionally change or delete values and cause components to stop working correctly. If you do not trust the source of information in this file, do not add it to the registry. Are you sure you want to continue? What this does is it adds information to the app compatibility flags. So that should hopefully make it work correctly. Wait. What you'll want to do to get out of this issue is go up here to File, Open Windows PowerShell, Open Windows PowerShell as Administrator. Now I'm going to type in my password. And I'm going to cut this part out. Now we have PowerShell open. So you want to take PowerShell down here. I'm going to type in CMD for the command to get the command prompt instead. I'm going to drag this file. Now you might not need to do this. What I'm doing here is I'm, um, I had an issue where this file would not apply in my regular permissions, but it would as an administrator. Um, so this is a second take. I'm kind of splicing these together. Uh, if you're running as an administrator, this should be fine. But as a regular user, you'll need to open up an administrator PowerShell or command prompt and drag this right down into here. No wait, you can't do that. You'll type in whatever the file name is and then hit tab to to do file completion file name completion if if it's the right one. Make sure it's the right one, then you hit enter. And then it asks you, are you sure you want to continue with this? And then hit yes. And then it says it's successfully been added to the registry. And now we can check uh, VMware workstation to see that it has been applied so now it works so that's good yeah it appears that works goodbye for now